Hello there everyone, welcome to another episode of this um, Terran campaign here on Master of Orion. Right now guys, uh, I'm gonna go and attack this uh, space pirate. Actually, I'm just gonna take command to see how big my, uh, my fleet shows up. That's nice. It's about the biggest fleet that I've ever seen here on Master of Orion for, some, for, for now. Right, they're going on a single line. Wedge formation, square formation, that's for beam defense. Let's go for wedge formation. And let's go there. Do they form up properly? Yes, they do. I don't know what is this means, or what these controls mean, but... really know that they are going to die. <laughs> of course, with so much going on. Yeah, that was to be expected. Right, this fleet, I kind of like them over there, so that's where I'm going to move them. Let's go for it. So, a couple of, of turns where you see that it's mostly about building up. It's mostly about building up here. So, um, that's interesting. Our engineers have made a new Good. discovery, my liege. Good, let's choose the research. I'm going for Xenology in order to get to Galactic Trading. Galactic Trading is really cool. Hmm, it's new, decent. Teaching methods. What do we have? Espionage. I really don't want that. That's nice. That's nice. Astrobiology gives me the subterranean farms. Gaia transformation, that's perfect. So much stuff to build. Class 10 shield. Planetary barrier shield. Empire credits plus 100%. Whoa! That's nice. That gives me the class 7 shield. Let me see where are the planetoid construction. It gives me the Doom Star. <laughs> That's nice. This gives me the where's the other Astro construction. This gives me the Titan. That's a good purpose to go. It's not that far away when you think about it. Yeah. So let's just go Xenology into Galactic Trading. Yeah, I feel like that's that's something that I need. I'm I'm in need of money. Robo miners. I could get this, but I don't like the maintenance for just the buyout cost. This is something that I can buy in the late game. Uh, I think that's the purpose for it. For now, I'm just going to go into terraforming. Yeah. feel like it's, it's better. It's a good project to go into terraforming right now. Move. Let's go next turn. Yep. I think I have enough credits, or I might have enough credits in the next couple of turns to do a research or a, a, a trade treaty here with the Meklars. Yeah, they don't have a lot of strength with that fleet, right? I could overcome them. And if I would overcome them, I would conquer them. I think it's actually probably the best spot is to attack the Meklar right in a couple of turns. So I could start producing some tro some troop transports. That would be nice. That would be nice. Right, this is a volcanic one. I think I'm going to go for toxic processor. Yeah. Fleet that needs orders. You're going to defend. You're going to guard there. It's okay. No, just going against the Meklar because they're quite... Uh, near me, and by conquering them, I would have so many planets available that I would conquer them, you know, and colonize them all. And that would mean I would have all of this to me, which is perfect, actually. Yeah. But in order to do that, I would really like to have something on X. Okay, the annual payment has expired, which is good. No, that's a big planning around, you know, guys. I'm just checking in if these provide any command or something like that. Right, I could give get the spy center here. Because finally, that would allow me some espionage. Because the espionage, yeah, 
I still don't have it. That's something that I gotta go into. Let's move all fleets. Um, still don't have enough credits, but I think on the next turn I have enough credits to a uh, trade pact. Maybe the, the humans instead of the mechlars. That will still give me money. Let's see. A brief interruption. Oh, view colony. There's one starving. Oh, okay. That's because it went on strike. No worries. That's good. Thank you for that. Terraforming was completed. This is now a Terran planet. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Can get robo miners. How how is the population? It can get a lot of population. So let's just go immediately cloning center. Come on, I told you to build it. That's it. Good. Uh, move server three has grown. That's perfect. Let's check out that the fleet needs orders. Oh, hi there. Can't move in over here? I think I can yet. Yep. Next turn. I'll be able to re to check those out. Oh, I really need to get in into diplomacy and get some trade going. Probably the humans. I'm already at a <coughs> at an alliance. Let's see who has the most credits. These guys have credits. So the Sakura, look at that population, it's amazing. 49, 47, 80. Not enough credits, so the only guys that have credits probably for this are these guys. And they're at war with the Chakra. Right. So that's not good. If I go against one or the other, they won't like me. But if I go with an audience with the Mechlar, they might have enough credits for the trade treaty. I don't have enough for one! Oh god. Next turn then. Oh, lots of Robo Miners. Now I don't have... you can see that I don't have command points. Since I don't have command points, I'm gonna have to focus if there's any places where I don't have star bases. And build them up. That's it. Same thing. Let's go for star bases everywhere. Right, another normal miners. Star bases. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. Advanced data center here. That's nice. What can you build? I could go for terraforming. And I think I shall. I think I shall. This one should be important. Let's move. See the threatening fleet. It's not really that threatening. Arak Prime has grown. That's nice. And let's go next turn. Yeah, that's cool. So plans for now is to build up a colony fleet. No, not col colony fleet, sorry. It's to build up um, troop transports in order for an invasion on Meklar. I want it to be as fast as possible, but it would take a couple of turns, I'm afraid, still. Let's go Colonial Services. It will pay itself. Spy Center. Si Spy Center is nice. Could get a lot of troop transports, but I still don't get uh, enough on that. Let's get trade credits for now. Yep. Yeah. School, these have ones. Spy Alpha recruited a a spy. Waiting orders. Assign colony. Hold missions. Acquire data. Oh, hang on a second. Let's assign a colony. I can assign a, a one of theirs. New spy ready. Let's assign that. It will take four turns to reach there. That's nice. 
That's nice. I like how it works. No, you're gonna have. To, it's not like he immediately starts spying or anything. I am making a note here. Latest computations for open conflict are conducive to your. Well, I'm gonna accept that. I don't mind. And then I'm gonna get the trade that will allow me to offset that one. So, yep. Yeah. Because they are annoyed towards me, and I still am not in the position to fight them out. I need the star bases. That way, I can get all the the troop transports that I want. Fleet needs orders. We had just discovered this one. Let's go over there. Next turn. Oh, they are gonna fight over here. <laughs> The humans are attacking me? Why? Since we are allied. Take command. I'm going to destroy all of their other armies. Wow. Why are the humans who are allied attacking me? Well, I'm going to destroy them. I'm going to destroy them then. I think they're really annoyed with my military outposts, but oh well. Let's destroy... what should I destroy? I should perhaps focus on the smaller ships just to make sure that the cruisers... because I'm pretty sure that I can't destroy the cruisers. But maybe I can destroy the destroyers. Let's go for it. Maybe I can destroy those. Yep. Well, since they are, are betraying me, I'm gonna go full out war on them. I don't care. Troop transports and all that stuff. Which is amazing, because they are allied to me. Why would they attack? Probably just... you know... Just silliness. Oh, they moved instantly. That's nice. They destroyed all my shields already. And yeah, that's, that's immediately a destruction. Amazing. It was immediately destroyed. That was a nice fight. Huh. That was cool. He teleported there. Look at that, I got minor hull damage there. Yeah, auto resolve. I'm gonna get destroyed that one. It saddens me that things have come to this. Alright. So the declared war. They're coming in for me. Alright, that's fine actually. That's fine because I'm pretty sure Ooh, I'm pretty sure I'm getting destroyed. Well, I can move in over here. Actually... Yep. So where should I get some more ships? I think I should get more ships. This this is gonna get destroyed. Pretty sure. Oh well. Let's move. It's amazing that they have better fleets than I have. How many cruisers do they have? They have one, two... Three, if I'm not mistaken, right? Yeah, one, two, three, and plenty of destroyers. I don't know if they they have better stuff than I do, but the defense rating is better than anything. Yeah, and my offensive rating is not as good, so I would get destroyed if I'm not careful. All right, let's check out anything that I can produce. Certainly, we're gonna need cruisers. Yeah, and anything that is not building stuff, let me check Empire. Anything that is just building trade goods, you're gonna change to cruisers. Yep. Cruisers. I'm glad I didn't attack the Mechlars because this wasn't expected. No. It, it didn't change there. It's kind of sad. It doesn't, doesn't change. So I'm getting cruises everywhere. That's good. That's good. I wonder if I can get a trade 
or a, a peace treaty right now. They're refusing. I don't know why. Huh. Really don't know why they would attack me. But that's fine, guys. We're going to check that out on the next episode. A surprise threat from the humans. Well, they're not really that big. They have that fleet and probably nothing else. So, well, I was thinking on going against the Mecklers. I guess I'm going to have to go against the, the humans. Hmm. Interesting enough. Interesting enough. Pretty sure the best tactic here is to leave the cruisers for last and destroy the s get the destroyers and frigates first because that's a lot of missiles. It's a lot of missiles that will matter, you know. Yep. So one other thing that I want to check is that in terms of diplomacy, I might be able to get these guys favorable. What is it? Recording specifications. But well, they don't have enough tech uh, there. Right, open borders. Propose. Back. They don't like that. Fine, fine, get away. Right, guys, that'll be on the next episode. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye. Cheers!